In Wisconsin, the police questioned an African-American woman as she was stumping for votes because someone thought she looked suspicious. Jerika Duncan has this story. 47-year-old Sheila Stubbs was campaigning last month to be her county's first black state assemblywoman. But then police showed up. I felt humiliated. I felt outraged. I felt angry. I felt embarrassed. Madison, Wisconsin police say they got a 911 call about a suspicious vehicle. The police report says the male caller, quote, thinks they are waiting for drugs at the local drug house. The female officer went on to question Stubbs. And she says, well, how do you know what doors to knock on? And I said, the walk list. And she said, can I see it? And I said, sure, here you go. And then she said, I'm really sorry that that happened to you. Stubbs' eight-year-old daughter and 71-year-old mother were inside the vehicle. She's the second black woman to be questioned by police while campaigning in recent months. Hi, so I just wanted to inform you guys that we have this lady that's been walking up from Mather and she said that she had been walking from house to house. Back in July, a deputy confronted an Oregon State Senator, Janelle Bynum, who was campaigning for re-election. Bynum said on Facebook, I asked to meet my constituent who thought I was suspicious. The officer called her, we talked, and she did apologize. As for Sheila Stubbs, she never spoke to the anonymous male who called the police on her. But if they're listening... I want them to see that I made it. I survived. I am now your representative. Well, Stubbs won nearly 50% of the primary vote in her county, and since she's unopposed, Jeff, she will take her seat at the State Assembly this January. Interesting sound, but she says, I'm now your, your representative. All right. Exactly. All right, Tarika, thanks.